Hey everyone, we're going to go through a Dulwich College uh, question here today. So it says, says here, searching in sock drawer of his wardrobe, Graham is able to find 30 loose socks of assorted colours. Wow, 30 different colours. Brilliant. So, 30 colours. A third of them are, oh no, a third of them are white. I made a mistake there. A third of them are white. Um, and of the non-whites remaining, two-fifths are blue. The rest are red. Work out how many blue socks he finds. Okay, wow. Bit of a challenging question. But thinking about it, it's one of those questions where we have um, remaining. And what I always suggest to our students is to use the bar model approach for these sort of questions. And so we know that he's got 30. Let's draw a bar model for that. He's got 30. All of that. It's 30 socks, as it says. A third of them are white. So split that into a third. That's white. And of the non-whites, that means the remaining, which is here, right? This section of the non-whites remaining, two-fifths are blue and the rest are all red. Okay, so you've got two-fifths that are blue and the rest are red. So I'm going to have to split this up into fifths something like that okay not the perfect fifths but we hopefully get it something maybe like that more appropriately <clears throat> so now i've got two fifths that are what does it say red two fifths are blue the rest are all red okay so i've got blue blue and i've got red 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 okay so i've got this question here um, and it seems a bit tricky at first, right? But because it says a third of them are white, that must mean that I can work out a third of 30. Third of 30 is equal to uh, 10, I should say, right? But because a third are white, the rest, I was not right, 20 of them are going to be non-whites, right? Two-fifths are blue, the rest are red. How many blue socks does he find well if two fifths of 20 are blue well 20 divided by 5 is 4 times 2 is 8 so there must be 8 socks that are blue does that make sense now I didn't even actually need a bar model for this one because it wasn't as challenging as I initially thought but we can see that the bar model has hopefully helped you to see that the blue section here um it's just going to be two fifths of 20 and that's not too bad to work out write down how many pairs of red socks he could make now if he's got eight that are blue out of 20 that must mean that there are 12 red socks because 12 out of 8 is 20 and because there's how many pairs he can make 12 divided by 2 is 6 he can make six pairs of red socks is that okay does that make sense not too challenging this question right have a go at the remaining questions of the Dalich paper and let me know if there were any challenging questions that you found and we'll try to go through those in the future